In this lesson, we'll learn about scientific notation with negative exponents. So we, here we have 4 and 32 hundredths times 10 to the negative 4. So we can use our exponent um, rules to help us with this. We can rewrite this as 4 and 32 hundredths times 1 over 10 to the 4th. Okay. So if we write out, now we can do that as 4 times 4 and 32 hundredths times, I'm going to use the dot this time, or multiplication sign, 1 over, well, 10 to the 4th is 10,000. Okay. So really what we're doing here, we now have 4 and 32 hundredths divided by 10,000. So when I divide by 10,000, I'm actually moving the decimal to the left. And this becomes, mm, I'm going to write it this way, this way, 4 and 32 hundredths. I'm going to move it to the left, 1, 2, 3, 4 times, and I have 0 and 1, 2, 3 zeros, 4, 3, 2. So in standard form, 4 and 32 hundredths times 10 to the negative 4 is mm, 40, 432 and the 10 hundredths, thousands, 10 hundred, 10 thousands, hundred thousands, millions, millions. Okay? So I've moved the decimal 1, 2, 3, 4 times to the left. Okay? We have the three placeholder zeros. So let's just go the other way. What if I have a really small number such as 0 and... Oh, we'll just put some zeros on there, okay? Oh, no decimal there, we already have a decimal. So now we have a, this really, really tiny number, okay? We can rewrite that in scientific notation. I'm simply going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight times. I can move my decimal eight times. That becomes eight and seven tenths times 10 to the, in this, this is a really small number to the negative one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, negative eight. So it's like we're dividing this number by a really large number, which makes it really small. That's the end of our lesson on scientific notation.